there is a fire not too far from here. I think. Somewhere around here. Fullerton, I think, is what they said. So, let's see if I can juggle two things at once. One, driving. Two, trying to capture that plane over there with this camera. Phone. You know what? I do start carrying my uh, actual camera around. Why? Because... There's a fire somewhere over there, and you can see helicopters and the planes. Uh, I don't know what they're called. They fire planes. They don't. They don't throw fire. They just put them out. But I'm gonna call them fire planes or anti-fire planes. Um. Yeah. Is where the hell are they getting? There is no like. The, where are they getting the water? I understand that there still are. There still is some water here in California. There's no like um, reservoirs near here. So I think I remember when there were fires up in Brea Olinda, uh, I think like two years ago, two or three years ago, there was um, obviously there was still a water shortage, but they started taking water from golf courses and pools, which is kind of interesting, but. It is windy. Somewhere over there, maybe you can see it, maybe not. Looks like a plume of smoke. Um, if I happen to get closer, I'll keep um, recording, but I think it's like 104 degrees right now. And so, in my car, it is very hot. So, There was a ambulance that I almost accidentally hit. Well, I mean, it was uh, well, okay. it was barreling down the street. It was actually going on oncoming traffic and stuff, and so I had to pull a very dangerous maneuver to the right, which um, brought me down to this street, which I have no idea where I am. Oh, look, there's a helicopter, airplane thingy. If you know anything about cars and you hear that rattling sound, let me know what that is. <laughs> Anyways, I just want to point something out really quick as I try to get out of this fucking labyrinth. Um, if there's anything, by the way, look, just just take a look at some of the greenery. I'm pretty sure that's not the right word. That is around here. Um, You can see how green a lot of the a lot of the stuff is. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. One sec. I want to make this light because I'll be waiting for hours. Okay. So just take a look how this is a church. You can tell by the name the church. Um, but so much stuff is green. And there's a water restriction here where you're, you're only supposed to water twice a week. Um, there's no mandatory cutbacks like there is in LA. But, you know, they're just, I guess, suggestions that, hey, maybe you shouldn't be watering that much. And there were also signs posted saying, actually there was one funny one. It was, um, uh, brown is the new green, something like that. Um, shit, sorry, <laughs> my glasses are starting to fog up since it's so fucking hot. 
Um, so there's still a lot of green everything. I mean, at my house, my dad still waters, but you know, we have basically really brown grass now. It's all dead. You know, we're doing what we can to save the water. Um, but you think that you would think that something like this, I mean, if the color, I'm wearing sunglasses, but if the color is good, then you would see that basically that's all smoky. And then also way over there, which you're not gonna be able to see, is you can actually see where the plume of smoke is actually starting. Um, yeah, you, you can actually see where the, where the smoke is actually starting from and uh, it, yeah, it's, it's over one of the hills, um, just over there. So hopefully this is gonna have people, because like I said, there are no reservoirs near here, <clears throat> near here, uh, and everything is dry. So hopefully people are gonna start saying, hey, you know what, there really is no water. Um, and there's a fire, so maybe we can save the water so that we can save the land or something like that. That ambulance was going really, really fast. I see it was eh, whatever.